Hi children, today we are going to do ending consonant diagraph th, th, that will come at the end of the word and we are going to look at some words, we are going to read it aloud and we will try and understand it, ending consonant diagraph th, alright, th. We come at the end. We look at our first word. What is the first word here? Read for me. Yes, bath. You'll have to have a bath. Tap bath, shower bath. Yes, beach bath or bath in a swimming pool. You love it. Good. So this is bath. Good. Shall we look at our next word? Ending constant blend. Uh, Lower no, read the word mat. Mat is actually short form of mathematics. Mat. Yes, you love to do mathematics. You like to work out some. Good. Next, look at the next word here. What is it? Read aloud. Path. If you go in a garden, there will be a path. They will put bricks, and there will be a path. To walk. If you go on the road, there is a path for the pedestrian. A special path, both on the right and the left side. Way. What is path? Way. Path. Let's look at our next word. What is it? Oath. In the classroom or in the school, teacher, headmaster picks up leaders and tells the leaders what are your duties. Then there is a ceremony. They will take oath. That means promise. What is this word? Oath. Taking an oath means making a promise to be a good leader, to do all the work the leader has to do. Oath. Yes? Let's look at our next word. What word is this? Both. Both. Both the classes join together and we will have some fun time. Okay? Both the days, Saturday and Sunday, both the days are holidays, not working days. Both. Okay? Judy and Mina, both of you come here. Complete the sum on the board. Both. More than one person. Right? Next word. Shall we look at? Look. Moth. What is a moth? Moth is an insect. It is like a butterfly, but it's got dull color. Normally, moth comes into the house in the night when you put the light on. It's a dull colored butterfly. Mostly brown, dark brown, almost black. Moth. Okay? And uh, if they come and sit on you, they leave kind of powder. You have to wash it out. Moth. Good. And it belongs to the butterfly family. Let me look at our next word. Look. Read for me. North. North. Okay. Where direction is one of the directions. What are the four directions? North, south, east, west. Yes. North, south, east and west. Good. Now. North. If you look at the compass, there will be a marker, a pointer. Anywhere you take, it will point towards the north. Have you seen the north po uh, pole star? Pole star. If you go in the night, you go up in the, in the terrace, look up and see. You will see a pole star. North. It is in the north direction. Then you will know. So a compass, marina's compass. You want no direction. You look at it. Okay? It's one of the four main directions. Next word. What is this? Read for me. South. There's another direction. There are four directions. North, south, east and west. Yes? Good. Now, let's read together. Shall we? Ending consonant blend. Uh, bath. Mat, path, oath, 
boat, moth, north, south. Good. Now we look at some pictures. We are going to do an exercise for you to identify the picture and the word. Shall we do that? Let's look at our first picture. Now we have a whole lot of things piled up here. What is that? When you go to a shop to buy something, any material, they'll pile up things like this. What is that? Cloth, yes. They pile up different colored cloth for you to choose. Oh, okay, it can be white or colored or anything. Always you find the shop, cloth is piled up, folded neatly. Cloth. Do you use the cloth for? Anything. Water and cloth, bed sheet, for the bed spread cloth, anything. You need cloth for anything. To make the dress, you need cloth. To make any cushion cover, you need cloth. So, what is this? Cloth. Where do you get it from? From a shop. Every cloth shop gives you all kinds of different colors, patterns, flowers. And you can choose from. And you ask for how much you need. You need 1 meter, 2 meters, 5. They take and give you. What is that? Cloth. Can we look at another picture? Look. What do we have here? Yes, that is your tooth. Why tooth? Because there is only one. And if you have two, you say teeth. How do you take care of your teeth? How do you take care? You brush it, you wash it nicely, drink water after eating a sweet. If you have a, a cavity, go to the dentist, ask him for help. Yes? And how many times will you brush your teeth? Twice, morning and night. Good. What is this? Tooth. Tooth. One tooth. You have to take care of all your teeth. Each tooth in your mouth has to be taken care of. There should be no dirt. There should be no cavities. It shouldn't get chipped off when you fall down. Taking care. Of your teeth is important. What is this? This is tooth. One tooth. Good. Can we look at another picture? Look, what do we have here? This is where you live in. Yes? The picture of a globe. What is it? Earth is where you live in. Earth. Your mother earth. You live and there are other planets, many more planets, one of the nine planets. Now, what does Earth do? It is spinning all the time. So, what happens? You will get rain and sun and all the seasons is changing because the Earth is turning and turning and turning. Good. So, what is this? It's the Earth. You live on Earth. Your mother earth. How do you take care? By not throwing plastic, things you don't want into the water body. Good. What is this? Earth. Good. Can we look at another picture? Look at this. What do we have here? The little girl is very happy sitting in the tub. What is she doing? Huh? She's enjoying bubble bath. Very happy. Water, soap. She is having a jolly time in the bathtub. What is she doing? She is taking a bath. Taking a bubble bath. Hot, warm bath. And she is very happy. After bath, she will be very clean. Good. Fresh and clean. Good. Shall we look at another picture? Look what we have here. Now, it is family, it belongs to the family of butterflies, look like the butterfly, but it is not a butterfly. Butterflies are colorful, but this is a good moth. It's brown and it looks like the butterfly. It is a moth. You find it on the tree, you find it in the house, in the night sometimes. Okay. What is this? Moth. Moth. 
skirt. Can we look at another picture? What is this? Your mouth, yes. Full teeth inside. Your mouth. How do you keep your mouth fresh? After eating, gargling, washing your mouth and teeth, drinking enough water. Yes? That's how you keep your mouth fresh. You can have, choose some mint leaves and keep your mouth fresh. What is this? Mouth. Mouth. You must close your mouth and chew your food. Yes? Open your mouth and read aloud what you see. How do you read? Mouth. Open your mouth. Only then the sound will come out. Good. Shall we look at another picture? Look at this. What do we see here? What is it? If you want to make a call when you are outside, you must go to a telephone. Tell me that word. Booth. Yes. Very good. This is called a booth. You go, open this door, and there is a telephone inside. It is a telephone booth. Public. Anybody can go, drop a coin, dial the number, and you can talk. Booth. What is this? Booth. Good. Let's look at another picture. Look what we have here. Okay. Look. What is it? Path. Yes. This is the path you walk right up like that. Can you walk on the middle of the road? No. There is a path here. There is a path here for you to walk. Both. Left side and right side. On the road, there is a path. Pedestrian path. So that you do not get into trouble. Please read. Path. Path. Whether it is in the garden, on the road, anyway, there is a path for you to walk. Good. Shall we look at another picture? What do we have here? What is this? It is a holy book. It is a holy book. On the holy book, if you place your hand and promise, then you must only tell the truth, you must not tell lies. Yes? That is it. If you make a promise with the hand on the holy book, that means whatever you are telling is the truth. And everybody will believe what you say. What is the meaning of that? What is that word for it? Oath. Taking an oath. Making a promise. Touching the holy book. You take an oath. That means you are making a promise. Say the word oath. Oath. Can we take a look at another picture? Look what we have here. There is a bowl here and there is something in fine. What is that? A soup like that. Broth. You boil vegetables or you boil a chicken you bo and that water you take and keep it. You can use the water for cooking. That is called broth. It can be vegetable broth. It can be chicken broth or non veg any broth. Broth is, you put the thing, boil that water of the vegetable. Water of the chicken is called the broth. And it is used for making soup. What is this? Broth. Say it again. Broth. Good. 